Geothermal energy is generated and stored in the Earth's crust. The deeper into the Earth you go, the hotter the temperature of the rock gets. In non-volcanic regions, the temperature generally rises 2 to 3 degrees Celsius every 100 metres, the heat deriving mainly from the natural radioactive decay of minerals. There are several methods for harnessing this energy. Very low temperature geothermal energy can be captured at relatively shallow depths of up to 100 metres, where the temperature of the rock is generally below 30 degrees Celsius, adequate for heating individual homes with the aid of a heat pumping system. Low temperature geothermal energy is drawn from deeper into the earth, where temperatures rise from 30 degrees to up to 150 degrees. Rainwater which permeates the ground and is warmed by contact with porous rock is extracted through drilling and can require a replenishment of the water table. This form of energy is generally used for collective urban heating systems or for heating large buildings. High temperature geothermal energy can be harnessed from deeper resources, 1,500 metres beneath the surface, where temperatures rise above 150 degrees and results in the production of electricity. Geothermal energy is considered effective, reliable, sustainable and environmentally friendly, but by extracting heat from the earth, it cools the rock down, causing depletion of resources. If production is reduced, a geothermal deposit will replenish itself, although it may take decades or even hundreds of years to do so.